Hello lovelies, welcome back to my channel. This is Masov's Kitchen. I hope you are all doing well. It's nice to have you here. If today is your first time stopping by, a warmly welcome to you. Do not waste my time to subscribe and also hit on the red button to be part of this family. And to my old subscribers, thank you so much. So today on the menu is our upper prancer recipe. This is so simple to make. So let's get busy in the kitchen. You are proud to be part of Masab's Kitchen. You are proud to be part of Masab's Kitchen. It's very educative, very informative. Nothing delays, always the best. You are proud to be part of Masab's Kitchen. You proud to be part of Masab's Kitchen. I have my roasted cornmeal, chopped onions, blue crabs, cooked red beans. I have some palm oil scooped from my previous video, the palm nut soup, and I have my leftover palm nut soup right there. So I'll heat up my palm oil and then add in my chopped onions and let this cook for about two minutes. It's now soft and translucent, so I'll go ahead and take it out of the oil. You can leave some in the oil, but I'm trying my best to take almost all from the oil. This is how my mom does it, and uh, I grew up doing the same thing. I'll now go ahead and add in my amani, that is my herring. I had it in my soup. So I'll add it into the oil and then scoop my soup on top of it. So at this stage, I'll go ahead and add in my roasted cornmeal and then stir it with my wooden stick and then mix it very well. At this stage, you can see that it's very, very soft, but do not worry because the cornmeal will absorb the soup and it will harden a bit we don't want it too soft and we don't want it too hard i'll then cover it and let this cook for about two minutes and then i'll go ahead and then stir it again i will set my wooden stick aside and take my ladder to stir it very nicely and well and then go ahead and cover it for another two minutes after two minutes i came back checking it up and i give it a nice stir and test to see if that's what i want so i'll go ahead and add in my cooked red beans and then give it a nice stir i've been cooking this for about 10 minutes now so just look at it it tastes really really nice and the red oil gave it a nice taste Mas if you are kitchen. here and you haven't subscribed to this channel please do well to subscribe and also click on the notification bell so that anytime i upload a video you'll be first to know do not forget to share this recipe with your family and friends too if you really like this video do not forget to give me some thumbs up comment and like this video wow she now kono and yeah dan kasan 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 i will list all the ingredients in the description box below and if you want to know how i prepared my palm soup for this recipe i'll also link it down there as you can see, I added back the onions that I took from the oil previously. <laughs> Until I come your way next time with another delicious recipe. Bye for now. Smack like eater. <laughs>